Hello, my name is Neil Garg, and I'm a professor in the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry. My specialty here is organic chemistry, and one of the areas we pursue in the research lab is to develop new catalytic reactions. Our hope in developing these new chemical technologies is that we can provide tools for other chemists to use to then be able to prepare the medicines of tomorrow. One of the most versatile catalysts that chemists use is nickel cod. This catalyst has literally been used in hundreds of transformations over the last few decades. But there's a problem with using nickel cod, and that's the fact that the catalyst is pretty sensitive to air. And because of that, it typically requires being handled in a glove box. We've now developed a way to allow chemists to use nickel cod on the bench top, and that's by taking uh, nickel cod and encapsulating it in paraffin wax. So now one can handle this material right here on the bench in experiments that we think are pretty easy for anybody to be able to use. So undergraduate students are going to be using these capsules in performing the nickel catalyzed esterification of amides. This is an organic chemistry laboratory course taught by Professor Shuming Chen. Specifically, nickel is a lot more reactive than palladium in a process called oxidative addition. And that process is extremely fast. If you let just a trace bit of oxygen into your vial, your entire reaction is going to be dead. Organic chemistry has been taught the same way for decades. What you've seen today is we can get students excited about organic chemistry by having them carry out modern research-related experiments. And in this case, all enabled by new chemical technologies. What I hope this does for us in the long run is it really gets students again excited about chemistry such that they decide to pursue science as a career after they graduate. And I can't emphasize enough how important this is for us as society. We have only a growing number of challenges that we face and we need our students to go out there and become the problem solvers of the future.